Welcome back, gamers. We're doing live Talk to Alize. Uh, we're gonna see about going through this mine shaft, the medial circuit. <clears throat> Assuming everyone has tightened their straps and checked with their gear. Uh, just given the train ahead. It might be wise to leave some distance between us. Take it slow. Don't forget to check your surroundings. Okay. Be safe. Okay, so this I like how this quest is called the Mario Circuit. So, just uh, be careful in here. Ooh, the music cuts out here. Oh, never mind. It was just looping, I think. Yeah, this beginning part's weird. Yep. <laughs> I don't even know what music that instrument that is. Once the fiddles come in, then I start to like it. Because I thought this is the night theme, because I remember the day theme having like violins and something, but no, it's later. Oh, it's battle time! Press the wrong button, okay. Uh, so I like to do this and this. You're fighting mushrooms! This and this. Mithril cap. Oh, uh... Try Apex Arrow. I clicked something wrong. And Pitch Perfect. Well, you can save those for the next fight. Alright, continue through the cave. I don't think I applied both my dots. I think I applied one dot and then chose another move on accident and thought it was oh, my dot. Oh, <laughs> that's okay. You just gotta warm up. Also, still foggy brained a little bit too. You can just ignore him if you so wish. Tyler says no. I was gonna use my move since it, it literally just ran out. Let's beat him up real quick. It would help if I was pressing the right shoulder button. <laughs> oh no, Tyler, you really are foggy brain. Yeah. Just so your, our viewers know, I got a COVID booster and it really messed me up. Tyler's on the recovery from the side effects of a COVID booster shot, that's right. Well, at least he's able to pay attention that. to story and cutscenes, because that's easy. Yesterday he would not know what the hell is going on. Like, can we do no, this another day? No, if we tried day? to play yesterday, I would not have been able to play. Really? I would not even have even been able to read dialogue boxes. I felt horrible. Asleep. Why did I get interrupted? Enemies are gonna spawn. I was suffering yesterday. It's but now you are even more in a different way. More mushrooms! <laughs> I think you're missing one of them. But it's like a cone in front of you, so you kinda wanna aim your cone so it hits all three. There you go, now they're all getting hit. That top one seems to recharge a lot faster now than it used to. Did they change it? Yeah, it changed. It's uh, they changed. It's uh, it's proc condition. It used to share a cooldown with that single target one, but they changed how it pro like it, it's like a completely different ability now. Oh, you did barrage, and enemies are dead. At least Guido's here to keep you company, huh? Yeah. Okay. That meter. Uh, that's. This one, X? Yeah, that's Apex Arrow. That was your level 80 ability. I see the end. <laughs> I'm sorry, <laughs> I can't say I enjoy this song because... it's that, that opening I don't like, but the rest I do. Unfortunately, the opening is what you always hear first after a fight. Yeah, because it's got a replay, yep. Ah, uh, you're in the medial circuit. Oh. The Mario circuit. Mario. Do not get close to that mob. To your, on your left. That, that big guy. thing. That's an elite mob. There, are, Every map in every expansion has two elite mobs. That's one of them. He will one-shot you. Meant to be fighting with a party. Hey, a pile of leaves is chasing you! Oh no! What is <laughs> Genomos. 
You really gotta fight this pile of leaves, Tyler. He looked at me funny. It's casting mud spit. If something looks at me funny, I'm gonna teach him a lesson. Okay. Yeah, I'm gonna <laughs> kick it. Don't kill everything you pass, because no. like I said, they don't give like any experience. You could probably mount if you'd like. Oh, duh. You're, you are in the overworld. <gasps> I got my yol. You did. See? I like this part a lot. Yeah, the middle part's not bad. Now, why did I take full damage? I'm on a flying... Brown bird. Cuz. <laughs> Ooh, you got to a new place, Tyler. Where is it? Garden. It does. It looks like a yeah, an agricultural area. <gasps> Grapes. This, tune. Pumpkins. this tune's been around since like the, f the I don't remember that the base game had it. It's but it's an old song. Feels like it is. I like it. It can be like elevator music. You, okay, so you saw those grapes we just looked at. Those got patched. Oh, really? Because at launch, they looked like PS1 models, and people kept making fun of them. Let me see if I can they show you. They didn't look that much better. Well, no, you should see how they looked before. <laughs> oh. Let me show you. Oh, God. Oh, jeez. All I have to do is, t on Google, type in Endwalker grapes. <laughs> and people were making posts on Twitter being really sad that it's leaving and stuff. <laughs> I think I've seen those pictures on Twitter. It looks like a... <laughs> It like like a, the shape of a carrot, but for yeah, a no, bundle of that's grapes. That's like a, a gem from a PS1 yeah. Final Fantasy. Remember that we once lived until they got patched to look smoother, a little Ooh. better. So many people made fun of it, the devs found out. It's like, okay, guys, we'll patch these grapes in this one specific area. And it was really funny. Oh, man. Yeah. <clears throat> I wonder if maybe Japanese people were being a little bit meaner about it. Because I would have left it in if I was the developer. Yeah, and see, that's how they are fixed, as you just saw them. Yeah. They're more round and... Oh, I see. I looked it up, too. Yeah, just look up Endwalker Grapes. Yeah, I think Johanna's looking at it before and after. Because I see it's a double picture. Gather... Pictures. Oh, you got to talk to NPCs around here. Pictures for the, for the repat to look more... Jebkey. Who, what's his name? Jebkey. Jebkey? Jebkey. Ah, uh, hello there. We're not expecting visitors. Not with us. Not with the lift being restricted. How did you come down here? We walked through a cave. Oh. Ah, uh, the mine shaft. Well, you're a hardy. Well, yeah, you're not. just a farmer. Under normal circumstances, I'd reward such tenacity. But I'm afraid the forum is making our list way too long. It is funny. <laughs> yeah, apparently they're being swamped with a ridiculous amount of seeds. What, the forum wants a bunch of seeds? Yeah. Well, just... And they won't tell them why, they're just saying... The forum doesn't You'll tell... You'll find out in due time! Just mm, produce the, the seeds, It man. seems like the forum's telling everyone to do stuff for them, but without telling them why. No one knows why they're doing what they're doing for the forum. I mean, seeds would still fall underneath the migration right. uh, assumption that... By the way, ain't this place nice and pretty during the sunny day? Yeah. I'm glad it let up. Do I have ought to be taken down below, more than I can carry, and then some? Oh, he's being overworked. Okay, there's one more dude hiding about. Maybe in those... Oh, it's the grapes! The legendary grape forest or vineyard there they are patched grapes not even a joke i love it <laughs> oh she's oh it's a makote what crops are we raising well as you can see one is a variety of grape we patch these grapes we miss our ps1 grapes
Investigate the stacked boxes. Are we gonna find animals in these crates? You might. You saw one person have them. God. Don't try to get aggro on those. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> Just run! I wanna fight the vegetables. No! That's they're gone. I think you go left. Like up this. Jeez, everything's seeing me from like a mile away. It's right here. Yeah, there you go. And he's gone. Is that a golden yole? It was a it was a it was a golden bird, yeah, but not a yole. The labels on these crates, seed saplings. That was just someone's mount, Tyler. Sheaves. I figured it was someone's mount, but it looked like a yole that was golden. <gasps> oh, look at that! They're flowers. I still want my rattles though. <laughs> she even Johanna knows. Look at those Shut pretty. Up. Look at those pretty flowers. She's really far to look away, isn't it? Oh, it's voice acted. Uh oh, mysterious voice man. Hey. But they're more than pretty flowers. Heart blooms are attuned to ambient. He's got that dumb hair. This hair's not that. Well, bad. it's the forehead thing oh, again. Oh, the two head. Other, yeah. Other than that, I like it. Yeah, the two head is a little weird, but like it's a good hairstyle other than that. You don't seem convinced, but believe me, it's true. This ashen grey, for instance, it mirrors the anxiety and urgency of those working nearby as they rush to fulfill sudden orders. Intense feelings like those spur the petals to change color. Bright glowing hues in the presence of joy. Dark subdued shades for frustration or despair. Yet even with the collected wisdom of Charlie at our disposal, we've yet to identify the underlying principle of this empathic effect. They change color based on emotion. And there are other mysteries besides. Is that what those mood Although those mood rings are made out of? <laughs> Maybe. With too few sightings to map its distribution, and no closely related species to track, we've been unable to pinpoint its land of origin. And to further complicate matters. Every culture, even dimly aware of its existence, has given it a different name and mythos. Our attempts to study it via the historical record have been an exercise in frustration. As an avid botanist myself, I should one day like to unravel the heart bloom secrets. But I'm afraid other duties must take precedence. I will leave you to your thoughts. Thanks, botanist dude, for telling us about flowers. I want to see them with their pretty hues. Let's make the world happy. Yeah. Have you learned aught of interest? Uh, I learned about these flowers, and that everyone's overburdened with seeds. Yep. A flower that reacts to one's feelings. Strange. I must say, I have never heard of such a thing. This is all very fascinating. But as it stands, we fail to gain any significant insight into the forum's undertaking. Indeed. While there is certainly enough activity to support Arendelle's supposition that her priority has been placed on improving food production, unfortunately for our investigation, these workers were never informed as to how their duties serve the master plan. <sighs> if only we could interrogate the forum members directly. Yeah, let's storm into their place of business and I know. interrogate them right now. We have to go around this long way. What was that noise? Can we just jump? 
No, you don't hoid. Yeah, but we don't Isn't die as long as we're not in a fight. Wearing the same clothes. Did you say he was making his report? See? Same uh height. Erinville receives his orders from the forum. Would it not follow then that the superior to whom he reports is a forum member? Or at least a close associate. You mean to eavesdrop on their conversation? What of the risks? Who cares about the risks? There. We won't interfere with Erinville's work, nor will he be implicated as an accomplice. Oh, uh, we don't if know the guy. If you part, I can do this alone. Nay, I said myself that I wished to know Father's intentions. Oh yeah, his father's part of the forum, huh? Yeah, he's a forum member. So the forum members are just kind of like the leaders of this place? The leaders of the city, yeah. Right now. There's no like one person that's the leader. It's like a it's like our Congress. Yeah, it's like a Senate of people Parliament. Yeah, and they vote How things go She's hypnotized, Tyler. Oh, yes. That certainly sounds like a plan. I think she's having I'm some issues. Does she even know what the plan is? She didn't look like she was listening. No, she's hard focused on those flowers. Quickly. Erinville is on the move. We need to get closer before we lose him. Hmm, what's something this, fishy's going on here. What's the small race called? Lalafell. That's right. I think that they'd be the best for stealth missions just because of how small they are. I see. Maybe. Talk to your stole. They can hide in all kinds of places. Keep an eye out on Kryl. In the next episode, Tyler will pursue Aaronville. Okay, he's our friend, but we can't let him know.